Now at six, high school students considering a career in the medical field had quite the experience today. The University of Miami Holy Cross Health Summer Surgical Scholars Program is now underway. It allows students to shadow surgeons to get a first-hand look at what their future might look like. CBS News Miami's Trish Christakis was in the operating room and shows us a behind-the-scenes look. 16-year-old Sharda Gouda says she's wanted to be a surgeon since she was eight years old after watching her father in the medical field. Uh, he would always tell me like the cases he would see or the people he would see and he would talk about it. So I've always been like very interested at a young age by that. It's her dream to help people and today she got one step closer, learning more than any classroom can teach her as she's already practicing on this Da Vinci Council which is used in robotic surgeries. Well, I learned how to like use the uh, claws with the robot so it's like you pick I learned how to pick things up, rotate, and then like drop it. These students complete four 10 hour shifts where they observe surgeries, learn how to suture, and use the robotic laparoscopic simulator. As a kid, you don't really, it, you're kind of confused. You don't really know what you want to do. And, you know, sometimes the only way to really know it is to experience it. I was able to shadow like a neurosurgeon my first day, and I was like, oh, this is something that I really want to do in the future. These current doctors didn't have an opportunity like this. They say there's always a need in the medical field, so this is something exciting for them. You know, they have a very good idea of what we're doing because they're seeing us, they're watching what we're doing in the operating room, they're standing with us um, by the bedside when we're actually operating on the patients, we're explaining the surgeries to them. The program is available for students who are relatives of Holy Cross Health employees. In Fort Lauderdale, Trish Kristakis, CBS News, Miami.